what's up guys welcome back to my channel my name is Simon Onyango and uh, today's video I want to show you uh, just a walk around of my house I want to show you what's going in on in here and um, yeah I'll uh, show with you maybe what I have what how I got them and stuff like that now the purpose of this video is just to show you that people start from somewhere not just to have a pressure from other people you know yeah so i'll just walk you around show you the space and everything else so this is the main door the door that you get in from and then from the door you can see it has an immediate window uh not so big window but i wanted a big window but that's what i got so from the window you can see I have shears from uh, Harvey Interiors, very nice shears, uh, it's the heavy shear but I don't have curtains yet for the sitting room, I don't have curtains, oh, it's a one bedroom house, so from the door you can see the shears goes all the way to the floor, so from the door you come this way and then my immediate right that is where there is a, let me just set this this is where there is my heat press machine this is what i use to press on t-shirts when i'm making t-shirts you can see it's uh yeah that's what i'm using for t-shirts and then this is for mugs for vikombe and water bottle and then that's the paper cutter and then immediately there i have my water dispenser you can see so uh, this this table this is a pallet table i made it myself uh, i made it myself when i was still in the Bakasi. i just bought the pallets and uh, made the table so read my carpentry skills uh, what's important is not how beautiful it looks but it's stable enough to hold my machines especially when i'm pressing it still can hold it so that's what is important to me and then back at the door on the right we have uh, this uh, thing over here just a cupboard I, I used to use this as my closet when i was living in the in, in my bed seater so nowadays i'm using it as uh, to, to store my stuff you can see these are orders that are ready you can see they are labeled with the names these ones are ready for delivery and then these ones are being delivered today I'm about to take them to town. These are business cards, you can see, the business cards. These ones are business cards. So these ones are going today. And then this is my family photo. This is me, the captain, and then my younger brother, last born, and then my sister. Yeah, so this photo, we took it when we were visiting my bro uh, back in school. And then this one here, this is my 15, $150 shell. This thing costs $150. That is 15,000 Kenyan shillings. If you have that money, you can uh, holler me up. I'll put my number. You can send the 15,000 and I'll send you this thing. This is very rare. You can't find the exact one. And uh, I got it myself from a uh, from, uh, beach in Ukunda. Ukunda, yeah. Yeah, so it's going for 15,000. If you have 15,000, hold me up and I'll give you that. And then, of course, my headphone and uh, stuff. So this is also my deal. If you want to send the 15,000, you can send it on that deal. And uh, you'll still get it. So this, this, these are the water bottles. They have not been printed on. They are still empty, so I can print on them when i get an order i always try to print when i get an order and then these are mugs this and um, this is the black mug so you see the white part that's why we print and if you want it to be all black you put your artwork to be have to have a black background yeah so these ones are t-shirts that i've printed and i cover them there so that they remain new before i ship so up here I have boxes for the machine heat press machine eight and one and then this one is uh, the printer. I'm selling this printer at a throwaway price. 
at first I bought this when I was thinking that uh, it can help me but for the work I'm doing I need a I needed a heavy printer so it's still working I've used it for a single day only one day used and uh, yeah I'm selling it at a throwaway price I realized the resale value is so low okay so after this we have uh, down here this is the new printer that I'm using Epson Epson L30 series so this one is L311 you can see the ink it uses this is sublimation ink not normal ink so this ink you don't use it on normal printers for normal papers you use it for sublimation work and then this is my computer you can see this this palette I made this palette when I was making the table and this was to hold my speakers I'll show you the speakers in a minute it was for my speaker but I'm using it for this right now until I get a TV stand so up here I have a TV Sony Bravia now this TV is a 24 inch TV and I got it from I inherited it from my cousin Dev so it's an inherited TV I don't have a TV yet so that one I inherited and then I used this wall mount that can move you see it can move all around so when I'm walking over there I put it like that when we are sitting here to watch we are using it like this so I like the mount and then over here this is my office you can see I work from home currently so this is my office you see my arts from Fra Fra's art I'll put a link below you can buy some pieces and then that's my monitor first monitor second monitor and then sometimes I use my laptop so my notebook here mouse pad kabambe and then my my desk is a bit organized sometimes I like clean desks yeah more than anything else I can I better have a clean desk than a clean bedroom because this is where I spend most of my time so you want where you spend most of your time to be neat so behind where I'm sitting right now it's a bit messy you can see the cables and then the speakers these are the speakers that I wanted to put that thing on, to put on that palette but you know they are old old Panasonic speakers you can see very old Panasonic speakers and uh, what I know with them they still work fine so that's why I'm holding still keeping them I've not bought a system or anything I'm still focusing on the business you know so that is it talking of that we have a, a cable here I don't know it's too bright let me put yeah so this cable I have this cable over here this is what brings the internet to my house it's running all the way to the door and leaves from the door to downstairs I'm taking it from downstairs so we are cost sharing you can see it comes to this router this router over here and then uh, this one comes in and then this one goes to my computer so you can see the two I put this router here instead of that side it would have been neater that side but I've put it here so that it captures up to the bedroom so basically this place I'll clean this mess once I get a, a TV stand and uh, stuff like that so the router will be here and I'll get the router will be under the TV under the TV so I'll get another something called extender to extend it to my room so down here i have a mat uh, which it's dirty because mats are supposed to be dirty and then uh, carpet this particular carpet i got i was given by Harry interiors again i bought the shears they gave me the carpet for free because janet and peter are my good friends so i got this for free i got the tv for free and then I made myself that and then uh, you can see I didn't I didn't have to clean the house because I'm recording so you can see things here and there but it's fine it's not bad 
Now coming this side, uh, you can see the old sitting room maybe. Yeah, so that is it. The sitting room, that is how it, it is. It's not too small, it's not too big, but I think it's okay for me. Because I can work there, I can see it, I can do it, whatever I want. So I don't have furniture yet. I'm looking to get furniture, maybe from... from uh, I'll see who, who will make me good furniture. But I'm looking for a deal. You know, once you start a YouTube channel, you need a deal. So this is my kitchen. You can see my kitchen is here. So that is all that is in there. In there. Of, of course, uh, you can see the mugs. Most of these mugs are some of those people that they were buying. Okay, when I, when I was starting, okay, they are not here. But this is mine. And then this one, we made this one for someone. But it, it, there was a mistake with it. So we are using that. You can see also this. This is a black mug, the one I showed you. But you, you can see it made a mistake. It has a mistake. So we are forced to use that here in the house. And then some glasses, some cake. And that is it for the kitchen stuff. That is porridge. We took porridge for breakfast. And the micro cook and water there. Stock for drinking and stuff. So that is how my kitchen looks. And uh, yeah, maybe from this side I've taken. So from there, you come to the bedroom. You come to the bedroom. So from the door, from the kitchen, it's direct to the bedroom. You can see the door to the bedroom. And then... Uh, we have hot shower switch and light switch. Turn your hat on. So from the bedroom, from the entry, you can see I have another desk over there. That is the desk that I use it. I, I use this one mainly when I'm coding serious stuff and I don't want disturbance. And then the other desk for work and uh, and my business businesses. But here, when I want to really concentrate, I come to this desk. Yeah, because the other side, people will watch and story. On the other side, this is my bedroom still. So you can see how big it is. I have a desk over there. And then on that side, I have my laundry stuff that I need to wash. I'll be washing them over the weekend. And then I have two pairs of shoes. If you know me, you will only know these shoes so far so these ones are my favorite but these blacks are overtaking because these ones are the ones of beat so say is in deal that's equal fashion yeah so that is uh my bed uh, of course there's another window here and with nice curtains these curtains i got them from her interiors and they got the measurements right you can see exactly how i wanted it to touch the floor and that's what they did they took the measurements, made it nicely, and then it has rings. I can close it and then open it. Yeah, so this is my landlady's home. You can see it from, from here. Nice environment. I like, I like this environment. So she does a lot of uh, uh, livestock keeping. You can see it's green 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 place though very cold at times so from there you can see i have my bed this bed i also inherited this bed from my auntie i was given that bed by my auntie auntie maureen so i didn't buy the bed when i was moving out she gave that to me and then i got the this duvet and bed sheet and two pillows came from her interiors. I got them from her interiors. Her interiors, I work with her interiors a lot. They do quality stuff, you can see. It's very heavy and comfy, especially for this, for this weather. So that's why I got it. It's a six by six. It's bigger than the bed, six by six. So I'll get a bigger bed. And then these ones for maybe if I'm working in the sitting room, 
I take one of these and cover myself with it's too cold at night. Especially if you want to work until late in the night. So uh, one thing I didn't like with this house is the styles. Everything else are nice. You can see the wardrobes. Very nice, very spacious. And uh, yeah, so I can't put a very big bed over here. Maybe if I get a bigger bed, I'll put it this other side here. So that I can still use my closets. And then I'll move this one to either this side. I'll move this one either to that side or to the sitting room. But I need I need it this side mainly. Yeah, so over here, let me just put the lights on. You can see inside the bedroom. This is still the bedroom. Let me close the bedroom door. So inside the bedroom, we have... Um, the bathroom this is the bathroom so if you come in you can see the bathroom these are socks i told you i didn't clean the house because i'm yeah yeah so that is the bathroom it's not too small it's uh, spacious enough uh, enough for two if you know what i mean okay and then uh, on this side we have the toilet also not so small so the toilet is in the sitting room but the bathroom is in the bedroom i don't know why they made it like that but maybe because they assume since it's a one bedroom house visitors should not be showering here they should just be going to the toilet and out but they only honors should shower so nice shower, nice uh, mirror. This mirror gives me a lot of work. I have to clean it every single day. This place has hard water, it's not cold water. So when it spills here, when you spill hard water here, it becomes white. So that is why uh, I have to clean it every single day. And it's a lot of work. But it is because um, I like being clean. And then the toilet, I don't have a lot of stuff hanging on my window. You know, people put a lot of stuff that they don't even need, even things that are over. So I only have a few, maybe G kind of hair freshener and uh, my mop in here. But it's, it's uh, not small. And then one good thing with this one too, it also has a drainage. There is also a drainage in the toilet, so someone can shower here. If you have a visitor who don't, should not use your room, or maybe a house help who don't, you don't need to share your room with, they can shower here because there is that drainage, so they can shower in here. And then, I think that is the thing that is it so that is it and as you have seen most of this stuff i either was given or i inherited from someone uh, i was given by someone i didn't buy them myself because currently uh there is this pressure that people have that you know you need to have a fridge because your friends have fridge you need to have seats because your friends have seats so personally i tend to buy things when i need them Currently, I don't buy enough food to keep on a freezer because so I don't need a freezer, but I can buy one just for the sake, but I don't need that urgently right now. Uh, I didn't need seats, but currently I need seats because I have visitors and uh, they need to sit. So I need to buy seats. That's why I'm looking for someone to partner with so that I get seats. But I always buy things depending on needs, not because I should have them. You know, not because people have them. So if you are there and you want to move out or you want to settle or you are settling or you have pressure to buy stuff, just relax. Get it when you need it. Okay. So currently I'm just focusing on buying, on, on building my businesses. I have two businesses. That is um, Inkman Kenya, the printing business and uh, Forever Creators, which is a digital agency. So 
we do website development mobile apps like it's digital anything you want digital marketing and stuff so that is it and uh, i'll not be uh, editing this video i just want to put it the way it is because i'm running somewhere else and w what you need to know i'm running a challenge called 20 in 20. 20 in 20 is a challenge that you put 20 videos in 20 days this is my second video for the 20 days and uh if you are just starting up you can join the group i'll put the group link on the description i can share it with you put 20 videos in 20 days my i'll be uploading another video tomorrow and like that for the next 20 days so join the challenge and let me see you on the other side otherwise let me enjoy my humble abode as you Maybe you plan to show me your house. Let me let me know what you liked in this house. What you liked, what you think I should improve, or uh, anything like that. You can see what I like most. My favorite part of this house is this is the sitting room generally because that's where I get to do everything that I need to do. If it's work thing, if it's business, if it's YouTube, I do it right here. Okay, so. See you. Bye-bye.